Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Debbie Church and if you're new then welcome to my channel. How are you guys doing? How are you feeling? What are you doing, baby? You blend in with the couch. We have a guest. His name is Gus. I wanted to do a spring obsessions, favorites, you know, what you need for spring video and things that I've just been really liking because it's spring now or spring is coming. Is it in like two days or is it tomorrow? And it's still a little cold. It rained yesterday, but there was a warm day. So I'm officially like in summer mode, not wearing pants. I love warmth. I'm not a cold person. I don't like the cold. And ever since Jorge and I left Venice, it's uh, it's been a change and it's gonna get a lot hotter this summer for us. So it's gonna be different. I guess I can just get started. I'm gonna like try to separate it based off of like theme. And so I'm gonna start with my dog and I'm gonna start with something for him. I love these sweatshirts. They're on Amazon. Amazon always comes through, but I love these sweatshirts because obviously he looks really cute, but these are really warm for him. It's been cold all morning and I don't know if your Frenchie is like this, but Gus is like so sensitive to the weather. Like when it's hot, he gets super dehydrated. We have to make sure he's constantly having water. And then when it's cold, he hates going outside. But when he has a sweater, way more likely to go outside. So to get started, I want to start with hair care products. And this has been literally a lifesaver for me. It's called the Magic Root Cover Up in medium brown. And it's a temporary concealer for like covering up your grays or your white hairs. Get an area where there's a lot of gray and you spray. Oh, oh, you can see it got onto my, um, my forehead. You basically just spray it onto your area that's like the troubled area. It's amazing. I think it looks really good. And it's like obviously temporary when I take a shower, it'll wash right out. But I definitely recommend this and it's L'Oreal, so it's super affordable. Next, we're going to do skincare. I have a lot for skincare. I keep meaning to do a skincare video, but I just like haven't. I'm just going to give a quick shout out to the Neutrogena makeup remover, uh, makeup remover cleansing towelettes them because they're a lot better than the light blue one. That's like the original because I feel like that one leaves my eyes feeling really itchy and scratchy and sore. And I obviously still cleanse my face, but let's say I need to clean up a little area around my eyes or if I want to just get like a layer off right when I get home before I actually cleanse my skin. This is always my go-to. For actual like skincare skincare, I have this. These are the goods. Okay, listen to me. Listen to me. If you feel like your skin has been dull and you want to spend a pretty penny, you need to get these products. So this is the Tatcha Violet C Brightening Serum. I love this. I feel like ever since I started using this, my skin has just been like so plump and so like bright and pretty. And then at nighttime, I've been doing the Goodnight Glow Retin Alt Sleep Cream. Looks like this from Ole Hendrickson or Ole, Ole Hendrickson. And it's the Transform Plus. I initially saw this because Desi Perkins did like a collaboration with them, like a sponsored video with them. And I like am obsessed with this. I just wanted to try it and it smells like, like it smells like cereal. I don't, it's hard to explain. Like it smells like fruit, like a fruit cereal. It's really good. And I feel like my skin is always so plump right when I wake up in the morning. This, is, this has changed the game for me. This has changed the game. Okay. And then next we're going to talk about Timmy. So um, this is actually their detox mask. I've kind of put a dent in it. I've used it around three times and I feel like it is literally a detox for your face. And I've tried a lot of detox masks and I've tried the charcoal mask. I've tried all kinds of stuff because I feel like my skin, although I don't break out a lot, my skin gets really congested. And then when it's congested, I just look really dull. And I tried this and I was like, immediately saw a difference. And when you do char when you do charcoal masks, sometimes you're like, okay, I felt tingling, but I feel like I still look exactly the same. And this was not like that. This was so good. It has all the good ingredients, matcha, lemongrass, and clay. That's what it's made out of. I highly recommend checking this out. And I recently did a collaboration with Timmy for an Instagram post. And the Instagram post was mainly for the detox tea, which I'm about to talk about. I was so obsessed with the tea that I went and bought that mask. Like with my own money, they did not send me that. I'm like obsessed with this brand. They have this new butterfly tea that I really want to try out. You can make it turn three different colors. So I definitely want to try that one out. For the actual like collaboration, I've been working with 
Teamy doing their 30 day detox and I'm literally obsessed. It's not that I would say that I'm a tea snob, but I kind of am. And I'm really particular with the way that it tastes. I like tea to taste like a natural experience. I don't like tasting like a bunch of fake sugar. A very rare that I find a loose leaf tea that I really like because sometimes I feel like they're too bitter, but this one is so good. This one is their detox tea and you drink their detox skinny tea every morning. So while the water is on the kettle, I'm going to get this ready. I'm gonna do the skinny tea and at nighttime I do the colon like pack. Uh, I love the skinny tea. I think it tastes super good, especially with some lemon. I'm going to cut up my lemon while I wait. Can we just talk about this lemon for a second? This was on my aunt and uncle's tree. Like this is a store-bought lemon and this is the lemon from the tree. Okay, it's steaming. We have a teaspoon of skinny tea and we're gonna place it in here. And then we're going to pour the near boiling water into the cup. You know, for my own personal taste, squeeze that in. Get all that lemon juice in there. And for the loose leaf tea, you wanna just put the strainer so that you don't get any leaves into your mouth. And you are good to go. And I really like this and it's such a cute packaging. They sent me the white one, but I know they have it in a bunch of colors. And I always add lemon to it, it's just bomb. Just bomb. I need to wake up, wake up. Grab a brush and put a little makeup. I want to get into makeup. The Benefit Brow Products, listen. I love Benefit's brow products. I don't know why it took me so long to start using Benefit's brow products. I think I just was using the Anastasia pencils for so long and the NYX micro brow pencils that I just kind of forgot about powder. I have two different colors. I have the number three and the number one. Brushes are kind of dirty, but I love the Jeffree Star Morphe collaboration brushes and just Morphe brushes in general, I think are a really nice, you know, bang for your buck. I love these brushes. I just think they're so soft. And this one I use to just kind of like set powder all over my face. And then this one I use for blush and contour and uh, bronzing, you know, multi-purpose. Then next I have an eyeshadow palette and listen to me. This is the palette. I am obsessed with these, this yellow right here and this pink and this orange. Like I'm obsessed with those colors. I can't wait to play with this green. It doesn't have any transition shades, but that's fine. Anybody that's gonna buy this palette has a transition shade. You know what I mean? I'm thinking about doing a look with this sometime soon. Okay, for blushes, I just need to give a shout out to Glossier. I've never had any of their products before and I've always wanted to try them. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna stop on Melrose and go to their actual store. Right now they have an art installation. This is a picture of it. It's so cute. Antelope Valley, it's so cool. I love their cloud paint. This one is in Beam. It's definitely more of like a bright peach shade. But when you blend it in, it just looks so fresh and natural and I think it's gonna be really good for spring. And then the other one that I got that I'm actually wearing today is in the shade Dusk. I really like the Glossier lip gloss as well. I'm wearing that one today. It's just so shiny. And I remember seeing their like, you know, Instagram commercial that just was like a girl applying the lip gloss and you're just like, whoa, it looks like she's applying water. I've been loving my over the top lip gloss from the Desi Perkins and Katie collection. It's just a shiny golden gloss. Can you see the little gold flecks in that? I'm obsessed with that. I actually bought a um, an extra of this one to put into a future giveaway, so stay tuned for that. And then I also have been loving the Gilded Honey Baked Gelato Squirrel Illuminator by Laura Geller. Like, listen, I have loved this highlighter for years, like a years. And for some reason, I always put it away, bring it back out, put it away, bring it back out. That color, I feel like looks good on a lot of people. So I'm obsessed with that. Okay, and then for music, my last favorites video, I talked about how much I loved Post Malone and I still love him so much. I think he's so good. And his new song, Wow, this is like my favorite part. I just love him. I just think he's so like fun and he reminds me of myself because I feel like I still stand by that we look the same. Okay. And another song that I've been liking, I'm Blueface, Buzz Down At first I thought I didn't like him at all and then I saw a music video and then I realized that he's just like this fun kid that's like having fun and like doesn't care what people think. If I'm out and his song plays, I'm gonna bop around a little bit. Over, pick it up, not break that shit down. The last song that I definitely recommend is Electricity by Dua Lipa or with Dua Lipa in Silk City. 
I, at first I heard the song and I didn't really like it too much. I don't know why I always hear songs and I don't like them and then I start to really love them. But one of my friends always played it, my friend Paige. Every time we got in the car together, she would play this song and I would just like, over time I really started liking it. I'll give you electricity and give it to you. Even if I could, I wouldn't turn on you. <laughs> and then I realized, I'm like, wow, this is actually a really cute little song. Yeah, and so those are things that I've been loving, things that I think you should get on um, for the spring. You know, I just think that, you know, we're all just, you know, trying our best here, people. We're just all trying our best. <laughs> You've made it to the end. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Please subscribe, you know, desperate call for help. <laughs> so if there's anything that you guys would like to see from me, please let me know. You know, I always say that I'm about to get back on a better roll, but I did officially finish my master's degree, so I got time, you know what I'm saying? I got time again. I'm starting a business, and I'm gonna do a whole launch video talking about what my business is going to be. Thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I hope that you guys all have a great day. Uh, it's always a pleasure. Bye! <laughs>